All right, what's going on, you guys? Welcome to Real Madrid Hub again. I'm your host, Dr. Jota, and in this video, I will be talking about um, one of the most controversial statements made by Carlo Ancelotti during his uh, presentation regarding to one specific player of Real Madrid, who is Gareth Bale. I mean, unlike all the major opinions about the possible future of Gareth Bale um, that were you know, pointing out that, pl that the player uh, would be out of Real Madrid the next season, Carlo Ancelotti confirmed that Gareth Bale can become, again, one of the most important players for Real Madrid. And in my opinion, what he wanted to transmit to everybody is that what he wants to revive, in my opinion, is the super powerful attack he used to have in Real Madrid when Cristiano Ronaldo was playing for Real Madrid. If you remember, Gareth Bale, Benzema, and Cristiano Ronaldo was, were the three more important attackers for Carlo Ancelotti. And he knows that if he is able to get Gareth Bale back on track, I mean, to inspire him again, to become again the super player he um, used to be in the past and all the stuff, and he encourages to Gareth Bale to, um, you know, train harder and uh, play better and all the stuff. In my opinion, he can recover back for Real Madrid that super powerful attack. Because if you think about it, if he can get the best version of Gareth Bale and then Karim Benzema, and then if we are able to sign uh, Kylian Mbappe, that'd be great, man, because we could have three super big names, three super big and important players in the attack of Real Madrid. I mean, Gareth Bale, even uh, considering that he's not in his prime right now, in Tottenham, he has scored 16 goals, which is more than Marco Asensio, Hazard and Vinicius Jr. together combined. So these three players has scored less, have scored less goals in the last season than Gareth Bale. And Gareth Bale is not even in his prime. So, in my opinion, he's right. He can recover the best version of Gareth Bale. We might have a super powerful attack for the next season. But let's see what happens with the future of Gareth Bale. So now let me know your thoughts about that. Just comment in the section below. And of course, subscribe to my channel, Real Madrid Hub.